Hey guys, it's Perlin here again, and today I want to talk about how you can use negative motivations and positive motivations and visions of your future to impact your actions in the present. So say if you want to change the food that you eat, and say you're eating like unhealthy foods at the moment, you're not really eating that healthy, you're sort of eating junk food or um, lots of like processed carbs and processed foods, and maybe you're not exercising, if you say to yourself, if I stay on this path that I'm on at the moment, so if I just keep my lifestyle as it is in terms of exercise and diet, what will my life look like in a year, in five years, in 10 years? Probably it's gonna look pretty much the same as it looks right now or worse. So you're, you're gonna get, um, you know, you're gonna get more unhealthy, you're gonna get fatter, um, you're not gonna be as motivated for life you're not going to be as energetic. You're not going to sleep as well. Um, you know, everything's kind of going to go down if you keep eating shit food. But if you say, well, if I start eating healthy food and I dedicate time into studying health and exercising and you know, researching what foods are good for me and going out and buying that and actively putting in effort to change my health day in, day out, what is it going to look like a month from now? two months from now, five you know, months from now? What is it gonna look like a year, two years, five years? It's gonna have a dramatic impact on my life. So I'm just gonna keep going up and up and up in my health and energy and vitality um, and drive for life that it's, it's totally worth it to put in that, that effort now to have a better future. So you're putting in a little bit more effort now rather than just snacking straight away on that junk food or that food that's you know, high in fat, high in like processed uh, carbohydrates and fat. And it tastes really good now, but you know, 20 minutes, you're gonna have an insulin spike and you're gonna crash. And then for the next you know, two to three hours, you're not gonna feel that good. And then if you keep doing this you know, day after day for a couple of years, your health is just gonna go down dramatically. But if you say, I'm gonna sacrifice a little bit of the uh, awesome flavor of the food and go for healthy food, um, it might not taste as good now, so it might only be like a seven out of 10 in terms of the taste that, that you know, I experience and the enjoyment of tasting the food now. But you know, in 20 minutes, I'm gonna be feeling good. In two to three hours, I'm gonna be feeling good. It's sustained energy that gets released from all the veggies and protein that I'm having, which is nutrition, whole food. And then if I keep doing that, uh, month, you know, year after year, month after month, my life is going to be, you know, so much better in the future in terms of my physical appearance, my energy, my drive, you know, everything in my life uh, will go from, you know, leaps to bounds because I'm eating healthy. So yeah, you create yourself a vision as a positive vision. So like if I go on this path or if I try and achieve this goal and if I make the habit of working towards this goal every single day, then in the future, I'm going to achieve it. You know, if you put enough effort into something and you put enough time into something, you're gonna find out ways to achieve the goal you want and eventually you're gonna get there because you know, you've got the belief and you've got the action to get there. But also, if you say the negative, if you go into the negative vision saying, if I don't do anything or if I do this bad habit um, over the months and years, you know, what, you know, how's my life gonna look like then? So you can look up these two things and so whatever situation you're in, at the moment, you can look at the negative thing. If I do nothing and just keep going the way I'm going, or if I slip into a bad habit, how is my life going to look? But if I implement some positive habits, or if I start you know, trying to um, develop a habit that will lead me to success in the long term, uh, what's that going to look like in terms of my lifestyle and my happiness and my achievement? Um, it's going to look very good. So yeah, th those are two little things that you can um, apply to your life straight away. Just picturing the positive and the negative of, of any action. And so, you know, if the negative of bad action, you know, what's it going to look like? And the, neg and the positive of good action, and what's that going to look like, you know, in the future? And that can help you make the right decision in the present, uh, regardless of how you feel in the present. Because, you know, how you feel in the present can go up and down you know, from, from day to day, from week to week. But if you have this sort of vision of, you know, what your life is gonna look like in the future, that can help you make a decision, uh, the right decision in the present. 
So that's a little tip that can help you out. I'll update you with future content and videos from this channel. So feel free to like, subscribe, and comment down below if you wanna know any more information about this topic or any topic that I talk about. That's it for now, talk to you later, bye.